Okay, today we're going to talk about our, uh, the fail-safe option on the Easy Stand Bantam Small and Extra Small is what we have here today. Now this is only going to affect you if you have a Bantam with a power-up option or a hydraulic option. And so what I have here today is one Bantam with a power-up option and one Bantam with a standard gas spring just to show you the difference. Now I have these both of these Bantams set into the supine option. And what you see here is when we go from sitting to standing in uh, supine, you'll notice that the hip angle isn't changing and the knee angle isn't changing. So I'm just loading weight, but I'm not changing position. And I can go right until my feet go flat to the floor, back and forth. Now I can do this exact same thing in the Bantam with the uh, gas spring as well. I can go from sitting to standing. Now when I get to standing with the gas spring, it'll stop and I can't go any further. Um, now here's where the fail safe comes in. On the Bantam with power up, once I get to that position, there's an override in the system that will allow the unit to continue going up into the standing position. So it won't just stop there. So you'll notice that now I'm going sit to stand and it hasn't maintained that lock. Now when I go back down to sitting again, it's still going to be in supine, but it's going gonna, it's gonna to just maintain my hip and knee angle wherever I left it off wherever I maxed out that range on my way to standing. So as I go up, now watch here, as I go to standing, it's going to go from the supine where the hip is locked and the knee angle is locked, and now it's continuing to stand me up into the standing position. Again, with the gas spring, it's not going to do that at all. It's only going to stop, and if I want to continue to standing, I have to take it into the sit-to-stand position to continue up to the standing position. So that's just a little bit difference in the way it functions. Now what you have to be careful for when you're working with this is if you've been using a Bantam small or extra small to prevent extending the range through a hip contracture or a knee contracture, you're going to want to make sure that you don't just rely on the unit stopping itself at a certain point in time if you have the power up or hydraulic option on it. You're going to want to make sure that you just manually or um, pay attention and, and don't extend that knee joint or hip joint further than you need to. So that's just a little update on the Easy Stand Bantam fail safe. Again, that applies to the Bantam Extra Small and the Bantam Small that have a power up option or a hydraulic option on.